In this video I'm going to show you how to create a form with a checkbox so that you can have the person who submits the form agree to certain terms and conditions and to do that on the left hand side I'm going to click forms and then click forms again here and I'm going to click new form in the top right hand corner and I'm going to call this a media release form and then click continue. Now by default we've got our basic fields um, I'm just going to get rid of gender, date of birth, uh, email address, and we'll leave phone number. And I'm going to click Add Field in the bottom left-hand corner. I'm going to choose Checkbox as the field type. I'm going to write, do you, uh, or we'll write, yes, I agree to the following terms and conditions. And you'll see the data type is a true or false. The input type is just going to be a checkbox. And I can click this where it says store terms and conditions. And here I can add the terms and conditions. I agree that my photo may be taken at this event, etc. Put in that. And you can see on the left hand side, we've got our terms and conditions box where they can tick it on and off. And if they don't agree to it, then it's required. If I want to make it so it's not required, I can just change this one to a zero, which means that they don't have to provide an answer and then we get our checkbox for this I want to make it required and the interesting thing is now we've got our form when we tick this store terms and conditions this uh, a snapshot of what they agree to at the time when they fill in this form uh, will be stored so that later on if they uh, if you change the terms and conditions and someone fills in the same form a snapshot of that will be stored as well and that's how we add a true or false checkbox uh, if I click add field in the bottom left, we can also choose a signature just to be doubly sure where the person can write in and put their signature in as well. Um, there's a lot of other different options for adding a field too, um, but that's how you add a terms and conditions checkbox and a signature field.